Let's go disco. That's the theme of this year's dance. Each year towards the end of the year, our school has a dance and the theme changes every single year. Like for example, last year was creative character. And me and my friend Ben, we went together and Ben dressed up as Star-Lord, which I mean, it is pretty cool, but the point was to be creative. And so I took traits from all of my favorite movies, Avatar, Harry Potter, and Star Wars, and I combined them. I was a Hogwarts student who was part Avatar and also a Jedi. I was asked if I was a furry about seven times. Looks like they're doing a new dance. Yeah, furry day. <laughs> it's still Friday, everyone. What? Yes. What does Trevor know? He doesn't know anything. Bro's like a third grader, doesn't know multiplication tables. Neither do I, but I know more. He doesn't know girls. I'm not scared of what Trevor says. The guy's in middle school. What does he know? He probably doesn't even know how babies are made yet. Well, hey, I know I'm asking to dance. Yeah, me too. Yeah? Yeah. Courtney. I'm asking Courtney. I'm, I'm asking Courtney. I saw her first. I get to I think we saw her at the exact same time. All right, all right, how about this? May the best man win. Yeah? <laughs> no, no, don't get... That's gross, dude. You said it, shake hands. Here, 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 here. Get away from me. Am I scared that Ben might go out with Courtney? <laughs> no, of course not. As charming as he may seem, the guy is just an idiot. One time in math class, our teacher asked him what pie was, and you want to know his answer? He said, Delicious! I love pie. Well, I mean, he isn't wrong, but that's not the correct answer. Want to know why I know I'm going to go out with Courtney? It's because I have a brain. Dude, I'm definitely going to go out with Courtney. To the dance, do some waltz, do a little bit of a oop-de-loop. Yeah. Brody? Nah, he can't. You know why? Because he's a square. Unlike me, I'm a circle. I'm round, no corners. Girls love that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> They're not going to get with her. All right, there she is. I'm going to see if I can make it look like I just got off my motorcycle so I can play it off as I'm a cool dude. Let's do this. Hey there. <laughs> I mean, I'm not a nerd. I mean, uh, would a nerd wear this sick, small motorcycle jacket? Uh, Maybe. I don't know. Uh, all right, look, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta be honest with you. Um, I don't own a motorcycle. I just thought that since you're really pretty, I'd try to make myself look cool so I could make a good first impression. So. That's really sweet. Okay. It was nice talking with you. I'll catch you later! Wham! Bam! Let's go! That's how it's done. Brody is going to be taking Courtney to Let's Go Disco. Full guaranteed. Man, did you see how she touched my arm? Uh, the fact that any girl did that must mean that they like me so much. I mean, I'm a bit of a socially awkward kind of guy, but I mean, I think Courtney thinks otherwise. I have a great plan of how I'm gonna ask Courtney to go to the dance with me. I got her these box of chocolates and I'm gonna leave them at her dorm door and I'm also gonna leave a note from me. But I'm not gonna sign it, so it'll be anonymous. And then I'll come to her later today and I'll ask her the same thing the note says. And it says, I like you a chocolate. Will you go to the dance with me? It's foolproof. Oh, hello, Ben. Hello there. I hope you should know that me and Courtney are definitely going to the dance. 
I don't think so. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. We were talking earlier today. Uh huh. You wanna know what you did? What? She touched my arm. Yeah, we have to my arm, bro. <laughs> Why do you always have to eavesdrop on us? No, bro, I'm just saying it. She touches everyone. Prove it! Look! Hey, baby mama. be a little bit different. Most people get like flowers and chocolates, but I think that's a squares move. As a circle, I get a pie. Hey, Courtney. Uh, hope you should know that I like you a chocolate a lot. So anyway, will you go to the dance with me? Are you the one who said the chocolates? Yeah, did you not like them? You shouldn't eat a gift before you give it to someone. Wait, what? I didn't eat them? <laughs> Oh man, Ben took the chocolates. Why would he do such a thing? Oh, wait a minute, no, I'm not surprised. He's done this sort of thing before. One time, I had a box of chicken nuggets, and I left them at my desk, and I left for two minutes just to go wash my hands, and then when I came back, they were gone, and they burped. That's how I know he ate them. Whenever I leave food away, and it's in his presence, he always eats it, and when I come back, he burps. That's how I know he ate him. I'm not gonna let him get away with this. I have to sabotage his plan. Hey, Courtney. Hey, Ben. So, I have like, something, uh, okay? So, I love your smile with your brunette, no, like with your blonde hair and blue eyes and your rugged smile and bulging muscles. Wait, no, actually, uh, that's a bad poem. It, I got it. No, wait, but like, it was supposed to be romantic. Like, I have something for you. <laughs> did you at least like the pie? Ha, in your face. Why did you do that? Because you sabotaged my plans. You ate my chocolate. I didn't eat no chocolate. Yeah, whatever, liar. Get right. Well, both me and Ben's plans of asking Courtney out to Let's Go Disco have been sabotaged. And honestly, I'm at my wit's end. I really don't know what to do. Usually, I always have a plan. Well, my plan may not have worked, but I think I have the perfect Hail Mary. Looks like I have to go with plan B. I'm just going to walk up to her. I'm just going to tell her my feelings. And after all has been said and done, she'll go out with me. Wait a minute, though. What if Ben's thinking the same thing? When did you last interview him? I gotta go. There it is, my beloved, my last chance. No! <laughs> It was Trevor. Trevor. A little punk mess, messed with our plans. I hate that guy. Little bitch. What a little bitch. Yeah. Hey, he's been on something now. Yeah. How about that. Yeah. You know what? He's kind of like Green Goblin. Does he have an alter ego? No. He's just ugly. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how he was able to win Courtney's heart. Well, yeah. regardless, we weren't able to get with her. Honestly, would have gone out with either one of them. You wanna know the real way to my heart? Shrimp. <laughs> no. Do you really think that I ate all Brody's chocolates? Which would then cause Brody to think that Ben ate the chocolates? Which would then, again, cause Brody to sabotage Ben, leading to the fight. And then, well, none of them get the girl? Yeah, <laughs> I did that. I'm sorry about not believing about the chocolate thing. It, it's okay, dude. It's understandable. I think we both got carried away. Yeah. How about the next time you get the girl? 
Definitely didn't leave a piece of shrimp out there so they'd fight over it. <laughs>